Today we're about to um, replace ABS sensor on the driver's side of that one. I'm not gonna buy a new one. I already have one on this one, so I'm gonna just take that one. That one's good. I'm gonna just swap it on this one. Should work because this one will have a light on for ABS. So this one has a light for ABS, and uh, we're gonna check it out. Make sure you have a scan tool that could read ABS lights because a regular engine scan tool will not read so make sure your scan tool can read ABS let's get it let's start this now let's um, look for the ABS code I'm gonna show you on this scan tool you have to press this ABS and you gotta wait make sure your key is on you don't have to turn on the engine all right, it's the code right here, C1121. C, front left, ABS sensor, solenoid. Let's hope it's just that sensor, cause sometimes ABS actuator be acting up. So let's change this first, it's cheaper. Let's get it. Take the wheels off first. Before you start now this is ABS right here right on the spindle that's a 12 mil bolt right here 12 mil bolt it goes up up in your engine so let's take this off this off pull just pull on it, it should come out like that be like that don't pull on it you might break the, <laughs> the sensor Alright, it's 12 mil. Let's take that off. <sighs> sometimes you're supposed to use a ratchet because sometimes these things get stuck in there. And after that, you're fucked. Then you have to take them out and all that. Mad work. So, use a ratchet first. Not a gun because this could break it. Now, wiggle on this, should be loose, like that, wiggle. Pop, just like that. Okay, let's see how it looks, let's look at it. Uh, a little banged up, but. Hopefully this is the issue. Hopefully it's not the, uh, the actual, um, the actuator. The main base, the main uh, 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 controller. So they say. All right, let's take this out. Connector is right there, like a burgundy. See that right there? Okay, you can reach in with your hand. Let's pull on nothing. See if I can reach it, man. I can't just, you could just pull it off there. Okay. okay. Now press it down on this and pull it out. Pull it out. That. You're really supposed to take this off right here. You're supposed to take this off, but if you could squeeze your hand in there, you good. Like me. <laughs> now, pull it out the hole. It's a bad one. Now let's get the new one. Well, the used one that I have from this car. From that one. I'm gonna use that one because that one don't have no code for it. Alright, let's do this. Let's do this. Got the new one. Well, old one. For you will be a new one. Put it back how it was. Let's put it in the hole. Nah, let's, let's, put it, let's put it through here first. Just be behind the strut between the, the link and the, sh and the shock the strut. Just put it between that first. Pass it through. I'll put it here. 
like so. Make sure you're going in smooth. You want to force it in there. Okay. Just like that. Bam. Okay. 12 mil bolt. 12 mil. Let's put some anti seize on here so it don't get stuck next time you take it out. You don't have to OD, so put it in there, put it in the hole, put it in the hole. Now, let's tighten this up. Okay. Should be good. Okay. Now, let's put this here. Put the other one on. This goes down. Alright. That's on. Another one up here. And you just put it in your hole. This. On it. On there. It. And should be an easy part. And connect it. Make sure this faced like this. Like that. Bam. Make sure that's up like that. Out. Just like that. Bam. Done deal. Oh, shit. Check if the code is still there. Let's do that right now. Let's go check if the code is still there and show you if it's good. If it's still there, could be the actuator, which I don't want. <sighs> All right, let's, let's, let's check this thing. As you see, my uh, ABS light is off, so mine was the sensor. So, if yours don't go off, it's definitely the actuator. Alright. Soon you're done, put your wheels on, put the wheels down. I'm not gonna put mine on because I have to do other shit on it. So, just when you're done, put the wheels on, put the wheels down, and the lights should shut off immediately. Sometimes you have to drive it. So, if the light's still on, it might be the actuator. That would suck. Actuator is not cheap. All right. So, if you have any questions, comment below. Follow me on Instagram. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Got more coming.